Yeah, this bike, I'm gonna put it back on the road, so to be dead honest with you, this bike is way more fun to ride than the TDR. And um, I'll probably hang on to that. Don't know yet, I'll just wait and see how this goes. I have have had this registered before, but it's just a fun thing to ride. It's uh, simple as. Um, oh, I just love two-stroke engines. And this engine here is probably one of the most beautiful torquey engines you ever will get. They're just absolutely awesome. Whilst I've also had this thing done at Extreme Engineering, that decompressor, they also modified my squelch band or squoosh band to stop detonation. Not that it was detonating too bad, because I've upgraded the CDI and I've also upgraded the um, upgraded the CDI, all the stuff in all your little coil pack coils and that are all new in here. Uh, new carby, flat slide, the whole thing, the whole kit and caboodle is pretty bloody good. I've had the front suspension done, MPE. I'm going to get the back suspension done. Just needs a service and a check over. And uh, put my blinkers back on and my mirrors and already got a re registrable tyre on the front end, the back. Bridgestone. Uh, they're their they're their road going versions of what you can use. So that's this big girl's going to go back on the road and I'll just deregister the TDR and have this this thing in the, and my little brat to run around the road on. Uh, this is just one of the most comfortable bikes, as so is the TDR that you'd ever get to ride. Um, bush bike. Like I say, I don't need to go fast these days. There's no doubt the sink can go fast if you're capable of it, but I'm all about self-preservation at 59 years of age. So I'm going to leave that Swan A Mick on an awesomely wet day, just loving the rain up here on the Blackhall Range. I love it. Swan A Mick out. <laughs>